All right, I'm gonna to try to upgrade this bathroom fan. This is the original fan that the builder put in this house 15 years ago. It's a cheapo, loud fan. See if you can hear what it hear what it sounds like. Turn it on here. I have a lapel mic that was just. Okay, that's what it sounds like. Shut this baby off. So I'm going to try this new tone, which is the same as Braun, I believe, bath fan upgrade kit. Reduce sound up to 45%. And the asterisk is versus the EC70 or 695C models. This particular model is an EC50. That's the 50 cubic feet a minute, so I guess the EC70 must be 70 cubic feet. Maybe it's a bit louder. Anyway, the existing unit is rated at 3.0 sones. This one is also rated at 3. But the reviews online seem to suggest that this one is much quieter. So we'll give it a try. Easy plug-in motor. About 25 bucks at Home Depot. So it's a cheap alternative to buying a new fan. Let's open it up and have a look. Right. Let's have a look here. This is not a complete fan. It'll allow you to upgrade your existing bath fan and contains a new motor assembly and grill. So it does come with a new nice white, more modern looking grill. So that's nice. And then the motor assembly. All right, so this is the unit that pops up into the existing housing. Uh, rated at three zones. 60 cubic feet per minute per minute the existing fan that i have is the ec50 model which is 50 feet a minute and three zones as well so this one has the same noise rating but the reviews online suggest that these upgrade kits are quieter than the original units so we'll find out slightly different fan design relative to the existing model. All right, let's put it in. Pull it straight down. There's these little tabs. So there's one screw here. The motor just plugs in with a standard house plug. And once that screws out, we can pop that old housing out. Give you a little closer look. screw out. So this is called a Robertson screwdriver. In Canada we use these for everything. Why? Because they work better. And the whole thing's a little loose. Whoa. I need a camera man. Okay, don't fall on my head please.
that's out. Now. The whole unit can just pull down like that. And there's two little tabs on the other side that just slide out. See? And that's it, then the whole thing just comes right out of the ceiling. Get the shop vac in there and just kind of clean up any dust. It looks pretty clean, actually. And we'll put the new one in. All right, little comparison side by side. The old EC50. And the new one, the 60 CFM upgrade kit. The old grill. And the new grill, I guess that's a little more of a modern look. I don't know. The old grill's not in bad shape. It's not really yellowed. And it's pretty, I've never cleaned it in 15 years. And it's pretty clean. Pretty clean. Anyway, I got a power source here. I was going to see if I could uh, see the difference in noise. It doesn't sound too noisy on the ground. And the new one. Try that old one again. Well, the motors themselves are very quiet. You can see the change in pitch when you put it closer to the ground, or when you put it, I suppose, in the housing up there. That's where the noise comes from, because the noise of the motor itself is very quiet. It must have to do with, if we do see an improvement here, just with the different fan design, maybe. You see that fan design? It's like that, very simple blade. Looks like a radiator fan or something. Versus this style of blade. Maybe there's a quieting effect with that. We'll find out. All right, you can see the two little tab holes there, or a little tabs go. So you just slide those tabs in first, slide them in there, and then just push the entire housing up. Up there, get the plug kind of seated, and then the screw goes back in there. And plug the plug in, put the grill on, and that's it. Very simple design here to do this upgrade. But will it be noisy? That's the question. Get up there, you bitch. Oh, come on, you whore. Go in. All right, now for the moment of truth, we'll turn on our fan again. It's pretty loud. Yeah, it's pretty loud. Um, I'd say it's the same as the old one, hence the 3.0 sewn rating on both of them. I guess I was hoping for a better result. So uh, I think for this one, I'll just put the old one back in and I'll return this and look for a more expensive, probably a bigger, lower sewn rated um, entire replacement unit. So my experience with this is it's if you have a rattly fan or something that's worn out or broken, you know, for 25 bucks, you can replace your motor. But I wouldn't expect a big noise reduction with this particular kit. Uh, works great. Installation is simple. But uh, three zones is three zones. Thanks for watching and good luck with your bathroom fan repairs.